Wrestle Series 10, 28 days away. Hello everyone. I have to say, after the events of last week, I'm feeling pretty good right now. I mean, let's face it folks. Watching our commentator, Johnny LaMonaco, take a shot at world champion Michael Carson was by far my favorite moment of the night. And honestly, Johnny, I don't blame you. Enough is enough. Michael saw last week that not only did he underestimate Johnny here, but he's been underestimating me this entire time. Like so many others before him. You see, last week, when he went to put his hands on Johnny, I didn't take very long to get down to this. Uh, hey, somebody... hey, production, could you stop messing with my microphone? That's just what As I was I about was to saying, say. It didn't take me very long to get down to this ring and show Michael just what I was capable of. You see, he's been underestimating me this whole time. A little event's coming up called Wrestle Series 10. The 10th Wrestle Series. One of the biggest events of all time. You see, Michael is going to underestimate me going into that match, the main event for the World Heavyweight Championship, and he's going to regret it. And it wouldn't surprise me because, quite frankly, let's take a look at Michael Carson's career. Michael Carson has been riding the coattails of his brother for far too long. And until recently, what has he really accomplished? When it comes down to it, Michael is old news. Let's just face it. You see, Michael should have been a world champion years ago. Years ago when Brockman Wilder, Derek Colt, Benjamin Nirvana, myself, when we were all here, he had that opportunity. He had that chance. But he didn't take it. Or he couldn't take it. One of the two. I don't know which way it really goes. Maybe Michael just wasn't good enough back then. But now he is. But the fact is. Well, speaking of the VWE World Heavyweight Champion, the last Carson standing, Michael Carson is here tonight. Johnny, avert your eyes inside. Maybe he'll forget you're here. Seth, now that I'm out here, say what you were going to say to my face. Oh, I will happily say what I was going to say to your face. You see, Michael, you want to run around, and you've been doing this for a while, saying, I'm old, I'm a has-been, my hip can't take it. But let's face it, you're almost as old as I am. You've been here almost as long as I have. You come out to this ring and pretend like you're one of the new guys of this company when you're not. You might be the last Carson standing, but let's face it, for a long time, Michael, you have not proven yourself in the middle of this ring the way that you should have. You have not proven yourself to be world champion material until recently. And I'll give you credit. 
I have to give you credit. You've gone up against some strong competitors as of late. You've proven yourself, Michael. But what about back then? You see, you didn't prove yourself back then, and you think that I am just going to walk in here and that I'm going to be some has-been, that I can't take you on. But you see, Michael, you're just as old as me. You're just as worn as me. The only difference is your accomplishments came late to you, whereas mine, they came very early to me. Wow. So, you know, all that credit you just gave me, do me a favor. Take what you're giving me, shove it up your ass, because I could care less what you think of me. I could care less what these fans think of me or hell, even Johnny fucking LaMonica over there. I could give two fucks less what he thinks. Seth, you're right. Everything that I've accomplished in the WWE came late because back then I had people like you, people like Brackman, people like Binbay, people like fucking Benja holding people like me down. And you know what? I got sick of it. The last three years I held WWE on my back when other people couldn't fucking do it. So, you're right. I do call you a, a has-been. You're a worn, you're a broken toy that nobody wants, Seth. Nobody wanted you here. And so Stuart Worth came to me and he was like, And hey Michael, I think we're going to go against, you're going to go against Seth at, at Wrestle Series. And you want to know what? Let's get real here for a second, Seth. Because everybody thought it was going to be me and my brother at Wrestle Series this year in the main event. But guess what? That didn't happen because I put his ass down just like I'm going to put you down at Wrestle Series. Well, you know, that's funny you say that, Michael, because you come out here and you say you're going to put me down at Wrestle Series, but you keep failing to remember one factor. You know, you want to call me a has been. Well, then let's look at the past for a second. Let's take a look and see what accomplishments have happened in the past because you're failing to remember one thing about Wrestle Series and the history I have with Wrestle Series, and that is I have never been defeated at Wrestle Series. So you might be the champion. You might be walking in with the champion's advantage, but guess what? I'm walking in with an undefeated streak that's not going to end because of you. <laughs> uh, talking with the big boy voice now, Seth. That's the, come on, that's the Seth everybody wants to hear. But Seth, I'm not afraid of you. Never have been, never will be. And you're right, you're undefeated. But guess what, Seth? Wrestle Series, you will be defeated because I am walking in, and you can bet your ass I will walk out. And I will carry either my lifeless body or your lifeless body out of the fucking arena because I will win that match. And you know what? You know what? You know what? I'm, I'm done with this. You know what, Michael? I got one last thing to say to you, quite frankly. You see, every time you fail to realize what I'm capable of, every time you fail to realize what Wrestle Series means to me, you see, this isn't just a moment like you're gonna experience. This isn't just a moment for me, it is the biggest thing of all time for me. Every single Wrestle Series, every time it's Wrestle Series bound, there's something that sparks in me. Maybe it's confidence, maybe it's destiny, maybe, in fact, it's just the fact that I'm not going to lose. Everything you bring at Wrestle Series. You're going to need it. Even if you bring the best you have in that ring. Even if you fight the hardest you've ever fought. Break out every dirty tactic you've ever had at Wrestle Series like every time before. I've walked out. While you are in disbelief, my hand will be raised. While you are wondering what went wrong, I will be holding the title up in the air. While you are staring up at the lights in the rafter, I will stand over you and you will hear the announcers say, your new world heavyweight champion, the Eliminator. But you know what? I'm not going to wait until the rest of the series. You're here, I'm here. Let's start now. 
Oh, look at this. A confrontation right now. And they're just slugging it out four weeks before Wrestle Series. Well, Michael just went for that big kick right there, but Seth caught him. Now Seth firing in shots. Did not expect this here tonight, folks. A back alley brawl between Seth Cameron and Michael Carson. A preview of Wrestle Series 10 in 28 short days. And big decapitator clothesline right there from Seth. Four weeks away from this main event of epic proportions. You see, Michael, you've been underestimating me this whole time. Everybody has been saying, where's the old Eliminator? Where's the old Seth Cameron? You will find out what it's like to face him. Because I don't care if you're 100%. I don't care if you're injured. The only thing I care about is getting my hands on you. You have screwed everything for me for the better part of the last nine months. You're the reason I lost this company, part of this company. You're the reason I had to come back as a wrestler. And you're the reason I'm going to go to Wrestle Series. Because if you think that I won Elimination Royale to win the title, you're sadly mistaken. I won it to get my hands on you. Folks, that match is only four weeks away. Wrestle Series 10, the greatest event in all of SL Wrestling.